If you have seen any videos on my channel, then you know I know a lot about helping clients purchase new construction homes. And in those videos, I share with you why you should hire a real estate agent to help you when you're purchasing that home. So in this week's video, I'm gonna tell you the 10 reasons why you absolutely need to hire a real estate agent when you are purchasing a new construction home. So stick around. Hey everyone, my name is Danae Hewitt and I am your go-to DFW Realtor with eXp Realty. I help people all across the United States relocate here to DFW and I also help people purchase new construction homes. Those are a couple of things that I specialize in. If this is the first time you've been to my channel, then you may or might not know that new construction is very affordable here in the Dallas-Fort Worth Metroplex. And I'll share with you a video that I recently did about a lot of incentives that builders are doing right now in the beginning of 2024 to get you into one of their homes. But when you go and you sit down with a sales consultant from that builder, you absolutely have to have a real estate agent with you. Okay, technically you don't, but if this is the biggest purchase you're probably gonna be making in your entire life, don't you want someone representing you? Yes, you do. And here's something you may not know. The sales associates that you were speaking with, with the builder, they don't represent you. They work for the builder. So it's always a great idea to have someone in your corner guiding you through that transaction. So here are my top 10 reasons why you need to hire a real estate agent. The first reason is to help you narrow down a builder and help you narrow down a neighborhood that that builder is in. So if you're working with your agent, you should already have like a buyer's consultation so that agent really understands what it is you're looking for in a home, how much space you want in the lot, and ideally where you want that home to be located. And what that agent can do is help you narrow down which builders are in certain areas. Like the builder that I personally built my home with, they are not, they are not in the north part of the Metroplex. They're just not. So if you want one of their homes, you're gonna have to come down south a little bit. So that's something that your real estate agent can absolutely help you with is doing that research because we know what to check out and where to look for you. The second thing that your real estate agent can help you with is builder incentives. Right now here in the beginning of 2024, we're seeing a lot of builders roll out the red carpet for buyers right now. They are buying down interest rates, throwing in refrigerators, paying for the owner's title policy, like all of these things. So your real estate agent can help you find the best builder that's going to give you the best incentives that keep more money in your pocket because I'm sure that's probably what you wanna do. The third reason why you should be working with a real estate agent is when you go and sit down with that sales associate, your agent is gonna help you to ask the right questions when you're sitting in with that meeting. Me personally, I work with a lot of buyers and I sit down with a lot of builders so I, I know the questions to ask. Or maybe I can ask a follow-up question to something you might be asking. Or maybe I can be asking for clarification on something because we want to make sure that we are getting the most and the best information when we are in that first meeting with that sales associate. So us agents, we know those questions to ask. And some of those things you just might not know to ask yourself. The fourth reason to work with a real estate agent is a lot of times the sales associates, they use like builder lingo or builder terminology and because they say the same things over and over again on repeat every day to new people that are walking in to them it's like almost a script in a way where it's just we're just spouting off the information I know how to say it but they sometimes they don't know how to really give that information and teach that information to you so that's why it's a great idea to have your real estate agent there to be another set of ears that you can ask follow-up questions to and your agent can help kind of reframe what some of those things that the, that the builders reps are saying if they don't make sense to you. So we're here to translate anything you may not understand that the sales associate is giving to you. The fifth reason is your real estate agent can be there to help you choose the best lot in that subdivision. And that's gonna vary from person to person. Maybe you don't want any neighbors behind you and maybe it backs up to a green space 
or it backs up to a park, and that may be perfect for you. So we're gonna be on the lookout for those types of lots. Maybe you want that corner lot where you don't want the neighbor next to you, or maybe it's a traffic pattern. If your kids love to play in the streets, you don't want them coming in on that main road in that subdivision. Now let's say, for example, there is an open field behind the new house that you're planning on buying and it's for sale Ooh, but then you're like okay well then if i buy this house on this lot then what's going to come behind it well look to your real estate agent and they can try to do a little bit of research to see potentially what may come in that area they may not always know the answer but let them help do that research for you so that's why it's a great idea to have your agent there with you to help you pick the best lot in that subdivision we are halfway through this list if you like the information that i'm giving you please Please like this video subscribe to my channel because you know the YouTube algorithm just loves all of those things all right let's move on to the sixth reason why you should have a real estate agent representing you when you are buying a new construction home and that reason is to understand the builders contracts so in Texas the builders have their own contracts that are drafted up by their own lawyers if you're buying a resale property then the Texas Real Estate Commission they're the ones that write up the resale contracts if you're putting an offer in let's say with an actual homeowner and not a builder so builders they all have their own contracts they're all different of course but there are a lot of similarities so it's a great idea to have your real estate agent read through that contract with you to help you understand what what it is exactly you are signing and there are things in the contract that are absolutely in like our normal resale contract so there's kind of no way to get out of that but it's good to understand why some of that stuff that you're signing is in the contract and that's why you need your agent to help you the next reason is if you're building with a builder and you get to go to the design center and pick out all the things that are going to go inside your house well your agent can help you choose the items that are going to be worth the money if you were to ever sell this house down the line there are things that you can do and upgrades that you can put in your house that are going to give absolutely no dollar value to the house if you want three paint colors in the house you're going to be charged for that third paint color that literally gives no value to your house like absolutely not it's paint on the walls if it comes down to the types of countertops that you get if it comes down to the types of flooring that you get your agent's going to be there to help let you know this is going to have more value over this if you want carpeted bedrooms that's not going to have as much value let's say if you have luxury vinyl plank throughout the entire house that's an upgrade definitely to have luxury vinyl plank all throughout and no carpet but you're also going to get more value out of it so if that's something that you want your agent's going to know where you're going to get the most bang for your buck in the design center the seventh reason why you should have a real estate agent helping you with new construction is having a home inspection you may or may not know this but the home itself is going to go through several city inspections everything is going to get inspected but you can also have a non-biased third party come in really maybe like a week or so before closing when that house is going to be completed and they can do a full inspection over all of the systems the electrical the hvac all of that stuff so your agent can help you navigate the things that come back on that home inspection report because newsflash it's not going to be perfect human beings build houses and human beings inspect houses so there's going to be mistakes of course we all make mistakes so that's why the third party home inspector is a great neutral party to come in and point out those mistakes so that we can give that information to the builder and ideally have that corrected the ninth reason is to help you with the blue tape walkthroughs okay now what are those when the home is like a week from being done, you, the builder, and your real estate agent, you're gonna have all these eyeballs all over the house, and you're going to point out imperfections that you can see cosmetically. Maybe they didn't run the paintbrush really well over this textured wall, so that needs to be repainted. Maybe the baseboards missed being painted. Maybe there was some caulking that didn't get done. But you're gonna go through, and it's great to have your real estate agent there to be another set of eyes to point out things. And honestly, 
if you've done this enough, you're going to know that your agent's gonna be looking at things that you may not even be on the lookout for. There are certainly things that I have caught in blue tape walkthroughs that I go, oh yeah, people may not think, oh yeah, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna make sure that it is correct and it looks good with this client's house. So it's good to have your agent in your corner to pick out things that you might not think about. The final reason is to help you when the unexpected happens when you are building a house. I have had some crazy scenarios where things have come up in the new construction home build that you, it's like, oh my gosh, you would never think that this would happen. During the pandemic, building a house took forever, literally forever, because labor shortages and supply shortages, it was crazy bananas. So I was helping clients navigate that and how bumpy that process was. And also recently I had clients that were purchasing a new construction house and the loan company had experienced a cybersecurity breach and we didn't know if we were gonna be closing on time because everything was shut down. So it was, I think it was really beneficial that my clients had me to lean on because I was calling people, I was asking the questions, I was finding out the information, and really so that they didn't have to worry about it so that I can kind of take on that burden and give them the information once I find those answers. Because unexpected things happen. You may think, oh, it's new, everybody know, everybody does this, no problems, but no, life in reality and things happen. So it's really great to have your agent in your corner to be there and to ask questions if the, you know, you know what might hit the fan. Okay, and here's a bonus. I'm gonna share with you two myths that you may or may not know about or may be thinking when you go to a new construction community. The first myth is, Builders don't want to work with real estate agents or I can get a discount if I don't work with a real estate agent and that is not the truth. When you walk into a lot of new construction communities, there literally is a sign that says, we love real estate agents. Please let us know if you're working with one. So don't be afraid to share that you have a real estate agent. And on the flip side, if you don't, they're not going to give you a discount on the price of the house because you're not working with a real estate agent. I remember speaking with one sales representative specifically, and she said with her her company and it's a big it's a national builder and she told me that they literally have like a line item on a spreadsheet where all of their expenses are going to be on there and the real estate commission is one of those expenses and they don't they don't merge them they don't rob peter to pay paul so they don't take one line item over here oh no real estate agent we're going to deduct that two or three percent and put that over here and give it to this no they don't do that builders know that they're going to have to pay real estate agents not on every single house but on some of them and so those houses that they don't pay a real estate agent for guess what they're just like keeping that money they know they don't have to spend it so they can put that probably back in their own pockets <laughs> for all I know but don't think you're gonna get a discount if you don't use a real estate agent because it's just not gonna happen the second myth is a lot of times you may be like out on a Saturday and it's just kind of casual let's just go into this new home builder well they have you register and put down your information and that's where you can put a real estate agent on there if you don't don't put your real estate agent's name on that card, guess what? That real estate agent cannot help you purchase with that builder in that community. So the myth is, I can put my real estate agent on that card or tell the builder later that I'm working with them now that I know I'm gonna buy this house. Absolutely not, you do need to tell the, the builder right up front that you're working with your agent. Even if you have no intentions of buying that house or you don't think you're going to, put your agent's name on there because I, a lot of the times, if you don't register with your agent's name, that builder is not going to let the real estate agent help you purchase that house. Even though they love agents and they wanna work with them, they just have to be told literally upfront that you are working with that rate agent. Well, did you guys learn anything new in this video? I hope you did. So if you did, please let me know in the comments below. And if you are looking for a new construction here in DFW, now is the time to purchase it because the incentives are crazy hot right now. So if you'd like to know what incentives builders are offering, please reach out. My contact information and all of that is also in the description below. Thank you so much for tuning in. I will see you next week.